Hello everybody, first month is here. New year is here, so I'd like to wish you all the best into this new year 2022 and I hope for all of us and all the people on the world this year will be better than the last one. About this channel, uh, I hope this, this uh, channel will grow up. It was, I believe, in the end of last year. Uh, it was about, I mean, in, on the break of 2020 and 2021. There was about 700 subscribers and uh, I believe this one uh, somewhere at, at the, the moment is 850 there. So maybe in the end of this year there will be about 1000 subscribers which will be which will be really nice. And of course I'd like to bring you some uh, good or even great uh, knife uh, content for the channel or maybe even something something more from these uh, let's say outside activities I mean some gear which I use as I mentioned it a couple of times so uh, now I'd like to show you what I did what was my last project and I wait for that project for a long time I was kind of uh, shall I do it and, and shall I not do it uh, for someone, maybe someone say, okay, you, you screw up the uh, nice knife and it is DPX Heft 4 Assault version. Actually, i show you how it did look actually. So it was this, it was this version, the black one, which is hard to find out now. Maybe even, even you can't buy it, I mean, as a new one, maybe second hand. Uh, you, what you can buy is this version without the black coating. They call it assault version, assault, sorry, assault version. So you can't buy it as I know or what I found. So what I did actually, I turned the knife into uh, American Tanto style EDC heft. Hest, uh, sorry, heft. I believe this one. So as you can see, and someone who know the knife, so what I, I changed a little bit the angle here, just just a bit, and of course the main is the is the is the tanto American tanto shape. What I also did is because of that I want to keep the yokote here, so I, I changed the, the angle of the of the blade, so it, it goes straight and slightly down to the to the yokote tip here. And what I did also, what pissed me off was the bottle opener here on, on this side because I said, what for you need that on the, some survival tool, hostile, envi hostile environment surviving tool. I believe that's the, that's the, sorry, heft, sorry, sorry. The name is heft, assault version, heft four. Uh, I mean, fighting, so it means fighting tool probably. So anyway, what for do you need a bottle opener? Someone says that you can use, use it for some prying like that. So with the American Tanto style point, you can do it definitely. And because there is, it's really like it's a steep angle here. Uh, so I'm not worried. I did nice, nice job a couple of times with, with the tip really how it's this one penetrates. Oh guys. So this is better for EDC for me. It's under, under 200 grams. So, for me, it's kind of light, light knife at the moment. Even I would stick it, stick a mini compass and a couple of matches in it. So you, you know the, the the handle is hollowed and uh, the the knife is skeletonized there. So there is a let's say pocket, the space inside of that. So it's all right. There is a hex, hex. Uh, Outside. It's set it up for for hex screws, so you, hex bits. Sorry, hex, hex bits. So you can you can attach them and use it in this way. So this is this is now now really. Uh, actually, this is my old old version uh, sheet for it, which I made many years. I got over over seven years, definitely seven years. This knife served me, so I was kind of bored because I got plenty of drop points now, and I said oh, I'd like to have some some tanto. Tanto, I mean the American Tanto style blade, some short, that's why I did it, some short, tough EDC, but somewhere about four inches blade, and it's hard to find with, with a good steel, I would say great steel, this is Nylux, almost about five millimeters, I say 4.8 or five millimeters, so very, 
very thick spine so this one you can see this one because as i said i changed the grind down and it doesn't matter sorry it, it, this one is rounded so you can't strike ferro with this even with this one now i won't change it because i did here so this is really sharp so i try this one and you can make sparks here so if if using this way so i can use it and i, I uh, firstly, I, I thought, so shall I keep this one there or not? Because otherwise it will be shorter and lighter. That's good for urban EDC. But I said, okay, maybe I will, I will, I will attach there some, some cordage, not because I want to use it, you know, extend it in, in this way, but because if I take it in force, you see the knife is still mostly black or somewhere like that so it's something unfortunately fall down so i will I'll put some orange cordage something like that so if it fall on the floor i will see it easy so that's why i keep it there otherwise it will be not there i always uh, also i also thought about to different to take off all these parts even the the um, the hex attaching i would say a device let's say i put it in this way uh, why because I don't use it that much and in my EDC pocket I got I got whole setup for it so better than this one so this is really if if I don't have blah 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 so it's not really needed for me but I say okay I'll keep it there because the extended handle is, is all right for the grip and of course it can serve me that's what I mentioned when I need to let's say break a car window or something like that so it's still working this way and of course this one guys if needed for self-defense it's really nice with the yokote it's really nice it's really it's really nice penetrating tip and of course if you need to use it in in some let's say soft way with this strike so this is really really nice so i'm glad i did it so i, I wait long time for it so which shall i do uh, it was a hard job. I did a couple of hours and because it's hardened nylon steel and as I said, I removed the whole the grind from all the grind simply and it, there was a secondary bevel high even before. So because I, I decreased the level of that, so I needed to regrind everything these hours. Hours spent on that, guys. Hours. And I screwed some parts of here, but uh, after time, it's hard to see that somewhere, let's say here, this one. So it's not wave, it's just, it just I, I just went too much down here, but after time of sharpening, it will, it will disappear. Uh, so I'm glad for it, even it wasn't really clear as I wanted, but it was a hard, tough job for me, for what I've got. I, I mean, so um, because of that, I found what I miss in my workshop. So enough, enough about this, this uh, Tanto Heft 4 now, Heft, sorry, for the, for the name. Uh, and speaking about the Tantos, uh, the next, the new video which will follow, I hope very soon, in a few days, uh, will be about uh, Tantos, American Tantos, actually Warcraft Tantos. So I hope I'll see you in my next video. Have a nice time, enjoy, enjoy this year, whole year, and as I said, hope will be everything much better than last year. Have a nice time, bye.